You have survived the darkness of the storms. You have survived the plight of your own inner wrath which you knew while within the time, would have only served you self-destruction. You, because of having survived the incredible evil of your past, you have accumulated a profound understanding which most people are never going to be able to perceive or even accept at its root. They will never understand fully your living journey, as most make the error of comparing it to their own, or with effort to assume that they know of your journey more accurate than you, the human being whom was ordained for to walk it. You have never abused your mind and body with drugs, alcohol, gang activity or even a life of overly sexuality. Your detest of any kind of escape in those areas, placed you upon the path of having the will of facing the reality of what is, in opposition to what is claimed by the numbers of what is desired as morally acceptable. Your perception of the life experience, will never be persuaded with designed traditional theories and ideologies which has enslaved and therefore, caged those in whom you were destined to experience for a given time. During the journey, you have come to know that, no one is permanent. Everyone as well as every living thing is created, has an appointed time of being present in your living, from their birth of meeting them, until the death of when you are destined of saying goodbye. These times are either verbal in saying goodbye, or simply the time of walking away. You observe after a time within your worst storms that, the effects of the storms have given you the ability and the will to walk away. These things of you, they will never clearly understand because of thinking and feeling as if you owe them explanations, while your living journey even unto yourself is, sacred and revealing. The times of when you were emotional and would weep, are not noticed of them to be no more, no more weeping, as this is due to being crushed at the times of the dark storms for the sake of bringing to your life, the light of truth that you may be able to move, forwards and into the new which has no place in them, only a place for you. Your confidence is rooted in the clear perception of the facts, as your responses upon every state of being is revealing of this perception and it's accepted. Those who were not ordained to suffer what you have clearly survived, will never understand the depth and vitality of your wisdom. Particularly those who think that they are your family and friends, but are in truth complete strangers. Your life is a clear indication of the universal nature of the soul. In this truth, it will be self-abusive to have the mind of thinking that the commonly programmed human being, will be a friend or a brother to your journey. It is a dangerous place to be that irresponsible. Continue to be nothing of what is expected and therefore demanded, as what is claimed as civil and religious based. Negate it without effort and therefore inner violence. Be all of what you are destined to become and nothing more or less. Understand that compromise is only death. If they never understand you and your response, then it is their loss and not yours. There are no worse people than those who are obviously determined to make it a point to not understand the truth you have accumulated of your past storms. But, they are never able to perceive that you are a manifested lesson of the great survivor. A survivor which they will never understand because of not giving themselves the opportunity to. The Great Warrior of Divine Love and Fury. Written by David Anthony Brable.